Thanks, guys. Now, Syracuse has had a fairly odd winter so far this school year. Just taking a look at the 2019-2020 school year in comparison to other years, the winter weather and the amount of snow accumulation is drastically different. Syracuse hasn't seen a foot of snow at one time this year. However, there's been two cancellations of classes due to winter weather. Throughout the past 150 years at Syracuse, classes have been canceled due to snow a total of five times. Now, two out of those five have happened this school year. However, winter weather is below average this year in comparison to previous years. During the 2018-2019 school year, throughout the month of January, Syracuse experienced a total snowfall of 23 inches. This year, only a total of 10 inches in snowfall has happened during the month of January. And looking at total snow accumulation for the entire winter, in 2018-2019, Syracuse saw as much as 89 inches in snowfall, and the year before that, 109 inches. So far this year, only 61 inches of snow has come across campus this winter. Now, I spoke with students on campus to get their thoughts on the intensity of winter this school year. Before, because so far, it really hasn't snowed that much, and it hasn't been that cold. To me now, kind of seem that they have a few bad weeks, but mostly they're fine. Uh, really mild, really, really mild. It was way different last year. As we enter March, winter is not over just yet. In previous years, Syracuse has seen as much as 35 inches of snowfall throughout this month. So there's still a wonder if that massive winter snowstorm is lurking in the near future. All right, now Liam, the sun was out today. It felt great. I had no idea that a winter weather storm would be coming. Nonetheless, rain. Any good news going forward? Can I see this rain disappear going into the next couple of weeks? 